Hello, my name is Dr. Srikant V. I am a practicing plastic and cosmetic surgeon. I practice at Manipal Hospital Bangalore and at Clinic Bangalore, which is also at Bangalore. Cleft lip and palate. Now, this is a very common problem. It happens all over the world in developing countries, in developed countries. It has got a very high incidence in our country also. But this is one of those fortunate problems which can be treated fully. These children with cleft lip and palate can lead a completely normal life. However, you should know a few things about cleft lip and palate. To have the best result for your child, you should have the surgery done at the appropriate time. The timing for a cleft lip surgery, the child is born with a complete cleft lip and palate, whether unilateral or bilateral, would be as follows. Within the age of three months, to get the cleft lip surgery done, the surgeon will also close the anterior palate, that is the front half of the palate. Then, at the age of nine months before speech begins, then you can go in for the cleft palate surgery. Now, this should be followed by a period of speech therapy. Now, during this period of time, at the time of the cleft palate, if we find that the eustachian tube is blocked, we will suggest that you can hear surgery called a grommet insertion because that grommet insertion will improve the hearing of the child. Now, when the hearing is improved, the speech also improves. Now, once this is done, the child is allowed to grow. Child goes to school normally. If the child has got a complete cleft lip and palate, the child will require repair of the alveolar cleft. The alveolar cleft is a, the cleft between the teeth that has to be repaired between the age of 9 and 11 years. What this does is to allow the teeth to come out normally. The child also has to undergo orthodontic treatment during this period of time. And once the child reaches adulthood, that is 16 to 18 years of age, there may be a requirement for a rhinoplasty or orthognathic surgery. Rhinoplasty means correction of the nose and at the same time any scar revision, anything that needs to be done which was not done to your satisfaction that happened in childhood can be done. The nose will be corrected. If required, your plastic surgeon will tell you to put a bone graft or adjust the bone or put bone graft on the sides. This is the commonly done secondary cleft lip nose deformity correction. In some people where the jaw is extremely receded, or as underdeveloped, then orthognathic surgery in terms of a sagittal split osteotomy to slide the lower jaw backward or a maxillary advancement procedure will be suggested to you. So these are the entire spectrum of surgeries that a complete cleft lip and palate child will have to undergo. That is one at three months, one at nine months, one at 11 years, one after the age of 16 to 18. These are the four surgeries if you do. People with cleft lip and palate will have a completely normal life.